What's up everyone, Danny Line and back with another CSR2 video. So the Trezo Millennial event is back up on the map. This is gonna be a rerun flash event. Now for me, it's starting me where I left off. I never finished this event last time, so I get to start exactly where I left off on the event. So as you can see, it's putting me right around race number 20 because I don't have my car that upgraded. I set it up for like a stage three live racing setup and I do have a really good video on how to drive this car. Now, if you've already finished this event, I'm not really sure how that's going to work for you, but if you did not finish the event and you do have the car, it's just going to put you right where you were to begin with. So the question is, if you did not finish the event, are you going to be able to redo the whole thing or is it just not going to show up on your map? I'm not really sure. Now, if you want to get this car, it'll probably cost you about 20 US dollars. More than likely, this will cost real money. It's probably not going to be in the crates for keys, but unless they decide to change something, it's always going to be real money on the flash events. But... You never know what they're going to do. This car is actually really good. So if you can afford to spend the 20 bucks to get this car, I would say get it. It's very fast if you max it out on only a couple upgrades. It does very good at live racing. And I'll put that live racing video or the setup video, or whatever you want to call it for this car that I made at the end of the video. It'll pop up on the screen. But there's a total of 29 races. You'll get some stage six parts, some keys, some game cash, some fusion parts, just the general stuff. There's nothing really too interesting in there other than some nice little prizes and whatnot. So it's a cool deal. It's not a must. It's not something you need to do. But hey, if you got the car and you got it upgraded, why not, right? Very cool car overall. But I think if you can get the car, it's definitely worth getting. It may not be the best car in the game, but... It's pretty darn close. Well, sort of, maybe. Depends on what you're trying to do with it. Different cars are good at different things. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and pop the video up of how to drive this car, how to set it up, the review and everything up on the screen. If you want to check that out, check that out. Here it is right here. Yay. Anyways, just a little quick overview and information about the event. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hit that like button and subscribe for more interesting CSR2 content. Hope everybody's having an awesome day. Check out the Danny Lightning merch store down in the video's description. Maybe check out the thank you or the join button if you really want to help to support the channel and good stuff like that. Catch you guys later. Lightning out. See ya.